Hi, today I will be walking you through setting up your Elmo document camera to your computer. To use your document camera on your classroom computer or your laptop so that the kids can see it, you will need two things. The ImageMate 3 software and a USB cable. You may already have the software on your computer. To find it, on your computer go to your spotlight and type in ImageMate. You will want to use the ImageMate 3. If you do not have the software, it can be downloaded by Googling ImageMate software and then clicking on Software Elmo USA. It will take you to the elmousa.com slash software site. Scroll down and find ImageMate 3. You can click on it and follow the directions to install it. Or you can get help from your tech person in the building or the tech office. Once you have the software installed, you will need to make sure your computer is hooked up to the Elmo. To do this, you need a USB port cable. You will plug the flat end of the cable into one of your computer's USB ports. The other end of the cable will go into the rounded square on the back of your Elmo. And there's only one way you can put it in, so don't worry, it only goes one way. Once your cables are connected, your software should open up automatically. If you're using the older ImageMate document camera or Elmo document camera, you're going to be doing the same thing. Your cord for the USB is plugged into the side with same as on the newer Elmos. You will still need the ImageMate software and you will plug the USB part of that cord into the side of your computer. And when you do, your image mate should come up and then again, you have your screen. So that's how you would do this. Now I will show you how to share your document camera with your students in a Google Meet while also being able to see your students. So I'm going to go ahead and join this and I'll show you what it'll look like when I bring the document camera up. So to run the document camera, I'm just going to present my screen, present now, my entire screen, a window or a tab. The window. And I'm going to have both of them on my screen so I can see what my students are doing. Okay. But now I can see that they can see what I'm doing with Elmo. Go down. I can zoom in. Okay. Now my document camera is upside down, so my hand is down here at the bottom. It should be, or it's up at the top there, and it should be. So I know that I'm upside down. So now there, that looks exactly like I have it on my table. So I'm going to do it right on here. Now. <laughs> You notice I flipped it with this little thing right here. So I can flip it back and forth. I can also write directly on this with my pencil if I need to. It's a little hard if you aren't good with your trackpad, but if you are and you want to use some of the tools that are in there, you can for highlighting, erasing, whatever. And that's it. You are good to go.